I'm here on Lake Ontario and I'm going to attempt this harbor scene. Um, starting by sketching in my composition and I've wiped out sort of where the water and the sky will be because they're so light I don't want to get any of that mud underneath. Um, I just toned it using mud from my last session. So you put in the darks in the background. And then I don't usually do this, but I wanted to get some of the lightest lights in there, or at least where they would be. And I put in some mid-tones. I'm just trying to mass in. It's so complicated. Just put in these shapes of mid-tone color. Um, the blobs, the lines. This is really hard. <laughs> I'm struggling. <laughs> Having some of the lights now. Working dark to light as, as usual. These distant boats, I can't really see what they are. It's just lots of little shapes. Um, so I'm just trying to find my way through. I don't necessarily do a great job, but I've never done something this complex before. Time for the water. This is a little easier. <laughs> Fortunately, it's been pretty calm all day, um, except it's been raining on and off. I have my umbrella though. I just use a golf umbrella that I bought at a big box store for like $10. And I just clamp it to my easel. And that seems to work pretty well. Starting to get some of the shapes of this closest boat here. Okay, well, they better stay there now. If you're there. I think it's a police boat and it just came right in. Staying there so far. I'm going really fast just trying because it could leave at any time. Just getting the major indications. This person was posing. This person wanted to be in the painting. <laughs> But then they left. Not enough time. I'm lightening up the green in the back because since it's raining, there's a sort of a haze over everything. Look at those beautiful silvers. Just throwing this in, no time. No time for this guy. Getting a little lost in here. Okay, reflections. 
uncomfortable. Very lightly, horizontal and vertical, back and forth, blending, but not too much. Pulling the color down. Ooh, pop. This is the brightest part of the painting, so I really wanted to make it pop. Time for squiggles. Finger painting. Adding the mass here. These reflections, I'm not really worrying too much. Does the water really ripple like that? No. But it looks okay. <laughs> I'm just using the knife to put in some of these far details that I can't really see what they are. And then final. Final little marks. And that's it. Thanks for watching.